Hey guys, it's Mia. Welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I'm going to be doing a boarding school room or dorm room tour. <laughs> this has been such a requested video on my channel and surprisingly, out of the three years I've lived in a boarding school, I've never once done one of these videos. I do have to warn you, my room is a little bit of a mess right now. I also have a roommate, but I won't be showing her side of the room, obviously, because that's her side. <laughs> so I will just be showing you guys my side of the room. But yeah, as I said, it is quite messy, but makes it more realistic, right? <laughs> okay, so let's get started with the boarding school room door. This is what our door looks like. So we've got loads of pictures up here, and then we've got this chalkboard where we always draw stuff. I feel like it's a pretty cool door. <laughs> So after you come through the door here, we have the back of our door, which has just mountains and mountains and mountains of coats, onesies, bags, you name it, it is on this door. And I don't actually know how we get it to close these days, but somehow we do. So we have Izzy's side, although that's my onesie, and then my side here. We got the light switch, and then we have the wardrobe. Wow! These wardrobes are so much better than the wardrobes we used to have. We never used to have doors on them. We've got a mirror on the inside, a nice full length mirror, which is obviously great for when we're getting ready in the morning and stuff. So I use this mirror a lot and it's definitely like the best thing they added into our new rooms. And then I've got my wardrobe. So we've got a shelf here on the top, a coat hanger there, and then space down here. And I have one of these, which I would so highly recommend you guys get if you're in a dorm room. It basically just hangs up in your wardrobe and it has different drawers and stuff where you can put things in. And it's honestly like the best thing I've bought. It really, really helps just organise my wardrobe. My wardrobe is typically the tidiest part of my room, surprisingly, even though it does not look the tidiest. But yeah, it is the tidiest part of my room. Next, we have the space where I spend most of the time, which is my desk. I have some dirty dishes here, really sorry about that. But this is my desk, this is where I get ready in the mornings, where I do all my schoolwork. So over here I just have this cute little fake plant in a plant pot. I wanted to go for like a wood and green theme this year so that fit perfectly. And then I've got my mirror, I got this from Wilco's. This is the best purchase ever. Once again, if you're in a boarding school, get a little stand-up mirror. You will use it every single day. And then I've also got my glasses here and my Apple Watch charger. We've got these really good plugs now where we can plug in like four things at once, which I love. And then just a plain lamp. We've got some shelves up here, which I don't really use to be honest. But up here I have my cotton pads and my cotton buds. And I just put them in these cute little glass containers. And then I've got some pins. And then I have some books that I'm currently reading. Here is where I keep all of my jewellery. It's just this cute little ceramic dish and then I've got a little pen holder over there but I don't put pens in that anymore for some reason and then over in the other shelf this is more of just like a decorative place I've got an air diffuser that little star and then this photo frame and I have no idea why this photo frame is empty but it's just sort of there and then on the other side of my desk I just have this cute little mug where I just put some scissors and it's for some reason got a random lip balm in it and then normally my straighteners are just out on the desk because I use those a lot and my laptop down at the side of my desk I have these two sets of drawers so I've got this drawer in here which is where I keep all of my beauty stuff this is a pretty chaotic drawer but surprisingly I do know where everything is I got all of these plastic little um like containers just to keep the drawer more organized and then I've got this makeup container in here as well um once again just to keep everything organized so i've got like so i've got hair stuff scrunchies hair clips nail varnish you name it it's all in here and then i've got this cupboard down here and this is kind of like one of those cupboards where random things just get thrown in i've got this little basket which has got some beauty stuff in it and a sponge <laughs> and then i've got i keep my folders in here and just like some extra makeup bags and stuff so this is really the cupboard where everything just goes in there and then my chair. When you look across from my desk, you see these three cute little pictures. I just got these from a place called Desineo Prints, I'm pretty sure. Um, and I just stuck them on my bed because I thought it added a little bit more to my room. I had originally stuck them there, but we weren't allowed to because it's new paint. Oh, and I also forgot to mention, I have these little fairy lights that go right the way around there. I think the fairy lights look super cute and they just add a little bit more to the room. My biggest advice to anyone who is trying to make their room homely is to get some fairy lights in. It honestly changes everything <laughs> down inside the desk we have a few more little cupboards so in here this is where i keep my day-to-day -day beauty stuff and then i've got some covid tests back there don't know why i've got these little baskets from wilco's and i just keep like spare stationery and stuff that i need on my desk 
When you come from my desk down to my bed, I have these little cubby holes and I honestly think this is like my favourite part of our new rooms. So in this cubby hole here, I keep all of my gymnastics essentials. I keep my pulse roll in here, my tape, I've got spare ankle supports. This is basically just like my gym little cupboard where I keep everything. And then you move down here and I've got some shoes. Those shoes need washing. I'm really sorry about that, but I've just got loads of shoes in there. And then down at the bottom, I've got my foam roller and my roller stick. And I also keep my trainers here. So this is kind of like a bit of a gymnastics shrine. Um, but these are so, so, so great. They were like the best things they've added in because they've given us so much extra storage. And then you reach my bed, the part we've all been waiting for. This is what my bed looks like. So we'll start off back here. On the back of my bed, we've got these really cool like shelf sort of things now. So on this side, I have this little plant once again, just to keep the foliage theme going. And then I keep my vitamins here, so I remember to take them in the mornings. This is a little bit overcrowded right now, but this is just a little dish where I keep all of my essentials really. So I've got my glasses in there. I keep my Apple Watch strap, a lip balm and a claw clip. That's sort of just like my little bits and bobs tray. And then I've got an eye mask there for um, nights when I want to go to sleep earlier than my roommate. My water bottle normally sits here as well because I like to drink at night. And then I've got this really cute photo frame that I got for my birthday a few years ago. It's just got two Polaroids in it. And I thought it sat nicely there just to sort of break the pink a little bit. We've once again got the really good plug sockets. And then down here I've got a wireless charger from Coconut Lane, which I absolutely love. It's so good, so I put my phone on that every night. And over on this side, this is the more decorative side, I've just got this little sign which says Wish Upon a Star. I don't know where I got this from, I think I got it from B&M or somewhere. And then we've got some more foliage in a little vase thingy. I really like this part of my room. I feel like it does look kind of cluttered, but it's very homely. Up there we have Buddy the Elf, and he managed to get here at Christmas, and he hasn't left yet. So he sort of just chills out and looks around the room. Then you move it to my bed. We've got a, I think this is a, just a single size bed. Yeah, so this is my bed. Over here I have some cushions, I have this cushion which says hello sunshine and then this little heart one, my teddies, and then I am the queen of blankets, I have three blankets on my bed, I can't live without my blankets, <laughs> I've got this cow one, a grey one and then a dark grey one, and these are an essential in my life, I can't live without my blankets on my bed. Over here I have this really massive fluffy pillow, I think we got this from Wilco's and I basically sit there like all of the time because I've got this really cool slanted wall so I sort of use it as like a sofa sort of area just to chill out, I do a lot of my work sat there because it's really comfy um, and I love it just because of that wall, I think it's so nice. <laughs> So then when you look above my bed, you see my pin board. This is a little bit of a mess right now. I probably should have, should have sorted it out. Um, but this is actually magnetic. So I originally bought loads of pins expecting to pin everything, but you just use the little magnet. So over on this side, I've got a medal that I won at regionals um, a few months ago, and I just have that hanging there. And then I've got loads of pictures going around the outside of family and friends, and then in the middle, I have some Polaroids. I always love putting photos up. I think it's just a really nice touch to the room. And I've got that cute little heart, and I don't really know where that's come from, but it's just sort of there. And then down here, I've got the... Oh, down here, we've got the fairy light switch. And I've got some fairy lights going around and I always turn those on at night, they add such like a cosy feel. Down below my bed we've got hundreds of cupboards <laughs> and drawers. So in this cupboard, this is another gymnastics cupboard, I keep chalk and my gym bag in there and then some turmeric shots. Um, yeah, kind of a deserted cupboard really. And then we've got four drawers here, so I just keep all of my clothes in these. They are actually, oh no that's not the best example, let's open another one. <laughs> They're pretty well organised as you can see. And then I have this cupboard over here, and this is another random cupboard. I've got like my projector and my shower stuff in there. Yeah, another kind of random cupboard. I seem to have a lot of those in my room right now. The next part of my room is the part of my room that I use the most, that is the messiest part of my room. And so this is my bedside table. It's not really on the side of my bed, it's sort of just here, but this is where I keep all of my food. Don't know if you can see all of my chocolate and stuff poking out of there, but it is such a mess in there, guys. But yeah, I just keep all of my snacks in there. Everyone in the house seems to use this as their snack cupboard because it's so big. At the top, I have a key little personalised cup that my friend got me for my birthday, and then I have my Galaxy projector and a kind of 
coke i don't know why that's there down by the window we just keep shoes and then i've got my charger thingy i can't remember what this is called adapter this is the view i've got out of my window i've got a view of a cute little tree and in summer this actually looks quite pretty because you can see the sunset over there so guys that is my room tour i hope that you guys enjoyed watching this video yeah i'm sorry it is a little bit of a mess right now i kind of wasn't expecting to film this video now but it's sort of the only time that i had available to film it so i sort of just had to get it done <laughs> if you guys are new to my channel make sure that you subscribe because i post so much content like this and i post lots of different content as well so i'm sure there is something here for you little self promo <laughs> anyways i hope that you guys enjoyed watching this video and i will see you again very very soon for another video bye